Close your eyes. Now, when I say open your eyes, not right now, I want you to, um, it's going to be eight seconds long. Okay, I'm going to count back from eight to zero. Four. Perfect. That's the best answer. I've never heard that exact answer. Like All right. Perfect. Perfect. Alright, cool. Oh, I'm We don't need a point last thing to do. Visualization exercise, okay? Last thing. Let me know when you're when you're done, when you're ready, okay? Okay. So and I imagine this. I want you to keep your eyes open as long as you possibly can. You let me know when it feels uncomfortable. You need to close your eyes. Just let me know. Count. Ten, nine, eight. Let me know. Close your eyes. Now. When I say open your eyes, not right now, I want you to, um, it's going to be eight seconds long, okay? I'm going to count back from eight to zero. And I want you to just focus on nothing, absolutely nothing, nothing, okay? Keep your eyes open as long as possible, okay? Open your eyes. Eight. Seven. Don't blink your eyes. Six. Five. Four. Three. Don't blink your eyes. Two, one, slowly close your eyes. All right, I want you to imagine the most comfortable place you've ever been in your life, your home, your family, in the forest, whatever it is, imagine this. Okay. You just step, keep your eyes closed, you step outside, and there's a big field of weeds and bushes. We're gonna walk through this. You start walking through this. But these uh, weeds, they're holding onto your legs very tight. You know? It's very hard to get through. Okay. Maybe it's 200 meters to the other side. The first step is hard. The second step is hard. The third step is hard. The weeds, the, the bushes, they're holding onto you to get through the field. But all of a sudden, after a while, every single step you take, it gets easier and easier. The bushes can't hold on to you. Nothing can hold you. Nothing can hold you. You'll get halfway through the field and it feels like nothing. Okay? You keep walking. You keep advancing. You keep advancing through the field. When you get to the end, the bushes and the weeds, they can't even touch you. They can't even stop you. They can't even slow you down. Okay? When you get to the end of the field, you let me know. Keep your eyes closed. Take your time. Good, okay, two more. All right, you're back in your home. The most comfortable place you've ever been in your life, wherever it is, okay? You walk out the back of your yard, it's a big crowd of people, big strong people. You need to cross between you and the big crowd of people to get to the other end. You start to cross, you start to grab you. They're strong, you start to fight them. You get a little more, more people grab you. You're still fighting. You get some more, more people grab you. The more you fight, the harder they hold. However, the more you fight, you realize someone starts to let go of you. And every more you go, the more free you are. Every step you take. They have stronger people, but they're falling off you. They cannot hold on to you. They cannot hold on to you. All right? You get halfway up the field, everyone's holding on to you, they cannot hold on to you. Nothing can stop you. Okay. You get 
better and better. Let me know when you finish crossing. Let me know. Give it time. Imagine. Okay? Last one. Wake up in a beautiful place with family. We feel most relaxed in the life. You walk outside of your house and you get to a field and you have to feed your family. There's no one there. There's a, there's a freaking gazelle. A fucking gazelle. It's there. It's fast. You must get away from it. And if you feed your family, you'll feel good about yourself, you know? If you don't feed your family, this gazelle, you know, it, it will escape, you know? So how are you going to trap this gazelle? It's afraid of you. Let me go. It wants to get away from you. It doesn't want, it doesn't want to face you. But you need to feed your family, you know? So, you think in your mind, every single step you take towards this gazelle, it gets more and more confused. The gazelle does not want to be with you. Okay. He knows as soon as you grab him, he's screwed, you know? He's done. And then you can feed your family, okay? So I want you to imagine, and I want you to describe to me with your eyes closed, after you're done, what happened? How you caught the gazelle? Go. Take, I don't care. Five minutes, two minutes. Take your time. Alright, so how'd you get to the zone? What happened? I jumped on the back and choked. Yeah? Ha ha ha! Alright, bro, open your eyes. Awesome. That's what I want to see. That's what I hear. This is a good stuff for you, huh? All right. <laughs> That's awesome. I like the answer. That was a good I never heard that answer before. I've done this before. I never heard it. I jumped on the back. I guess I would choke it out. I heard I cornered it and it couldn't walk away and it. <laughs> That's the only way to do it. Awesome. <laughs> That's the best Everybody answer. Knows. Awesome, brother. Awesome. Thank you, guys. That's man. great. Awesome. That's awesome. Does that visualization make sense to you? That yeah. visualization? Yeah, I like it. Because you imagine people holding you back and, and people trying to fight you, and then you imagine someone running like, away from you. <laughs> like I mentioned both. Because this can happen in the fight. Yeah? Four. Perfect. That's the best answer I've never heard. Exactly. It came up to my mind, too. I thought, though. That, I thought the like, dog on his back and choked the gazelle That's out. That's all we tried. <laughs> we tried together, you know. <laughs> <laughs> that's like, what I thought he yeah, would do. Like he would yeah. jump on the back yeah. of the gazelle and choke her up. Yeah, but that's the best chance you have. Like, they go, well, I'll try to corner it. If it runs, oh, I, I catch it three times and I'm like, oh, okay, that's cool. You know, it's not a bad answer. But I just jump on his back and choke her up. That's, that's a better answer. I like it. <laughs> awesome. All right, let's set up and let's get a picture of the course. All right. All right. Perfect. Yes. All right, cool. Oh, oh, oh I'm old man. Thanks you guys. Thank you. I really you. appreciate it. Hopefully that makes all the way. Ah, Hopefully that is because of the weight cutting, I have a little bad bad mood. I don't want to no, be disrespectful. No, 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 Du wolltest wissen, was es ist. Die Kamera wollte es wissen. Die Kamera wollte es wissen. Ja, wenn wir ein bisschen Panzertape kaufen, dann können wir das zusammen tapen, oder? Ja. Was hast du da gerade für ein fragwürdiges Kleidungsstück abgelegt? Ja, sieht man ja, dass es ein Plastikanzug ist, der hindert meine Haut daran zu atmen und deshalb schwitze ich mehr und das ist das, was ich in dem Moment machen muss, um auf mein Gewicht zu kommen. Aber jetzt muss ich duschen gehen, sonst werde ich krank. Aber ich habe kein Handtuch. Was? Er ist hängen geblieben. Ich, ich kann diesen Tag auf diesem Boot nicht vergessen. Ich habe sein Gehirn gewaschen. Mit griechischem Wein. Mit griechischem Wein, ja. <lacht> Im griechischen Wein ausgelöst. Müssen wir hier raus? Nee, 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 nee. Chill doch mal. Ja, ich bin ja völlig entspannt. Warum so hyperaktiv, Alter? Weißt du, was echt erstaunlich ist? Ich hatte Kopfschmerzen vor dem Training und jetzt sind sie weg.
Also ein paar Erschütterungen, ein paar Schläge auf den Kopf, ein paar Mal hingeflogen. Mhm. Und Spannungskopfschmerz, oder? Ja, äh, genau. Ähm, halt einfach durch den Nacken den ganzen Tag irgendwie verspannt. Hallo. Ich würde hier schon wollen, die alten Jahre sind schon vorbei. Peter, falsch. Also, wenn es so weitergeht, muss ich dir noch die, den Text ausdrucken vor dem Kampf. Das hat auch mit dem Kampf zu tun, nicht für mich. Na, das, das ist einfach das wie vor dem Kampf und dem Textkampf. Also, also wichtig. Das ist einfach die Gewichtung, dass man sieht, wie wichtig das Ding ist. Also, ja, das, das kann man nicht nach dem Kampf irgendwie lernen. Das ist extrem hohe Priorität. Ich bin so schwach. Ich kannte das Lied gerne. Ich würde meine Beine gegen den Du kannst das Lied nicht, aber da ist schon verdammt ich gut mitgesucht. Wenn ich Zivildienst gemacht habe und dann mit dem Kurvenstern äh, gearbeitet habe und dem das jeden Tag gehören müssen. Das ist jetzt irgendeine Anspielung? Nein, nein, ich könnte das Video auch erzählen. Nimm einem Mann das Wasser, nimm einem Mann das Essen und die Frauen, dann sieht er so aus wie ich jetzt. Ganz schön streng. Ja, der Fisch ist Entweder hat irgendjemand sie seit Tagen nicht gewaschen. Nee, das ist ganz normal. Business as usual. Danke. Kannst du ja bitte die Gleitcreme bringen? Ja, Schatz. Ja, bück dich nochmal. Und Andreas versucht jetzt nochmal genau weit unten hin zu massieren, äh, zu einzucremen. Bam! TV. Abonniert diesen Kanal. Müschi.